Alright, so howdy folks, my name is Richie, aka Bog Otter. And today we're going to be checking out War Pips for the very first time. Um, War Pips is coming out into early access on April 29th. And uh, I'm excited to be checking it out. Thanks so much to Daedalic Entertainment for sponsoring today's stream. And thanks to the devs, uh, Skirmish Mode Games. We're going to try the tutorial first and see what it's all about. And then we'll uh, we'll go from there. Let's do it. Establishing uplink. Welcome to War Pips. These tutorials will guide you through how to play the game. This is the campaign world map. You start at the home base icon and must capture territories to progress to the enemy base. Okay. Once you destroy the enemy base, you've beaten the island and may proceed to the next. You can only attack territories adjacent to the ones you control. The panel to the right shows you the high level information about the selected territory. Okay. You can see what enemy units you'll be fighting as well as the rewards for capturing the territory. Okay, so here's the enemy, little guy. 56, 56, 56, 56. Risa! Thank you, Gigabomb. Morning, Bog. Happy Thursday. Thank you for the 56 months. Appreciate it. Uh, so yeah, we fight this guy and then we get these two guys as rewards. Interesting. When you're ready, select an attackable territory and use the deploy button. All right, so I guess this is our home base here. Where's this one? Let's deploy. Let's check it out. Operation Smelly Comet. <laughs> okay, we gotta defend that and attack that. Protect this. I will do my best. Destroy this. I love it. I love the simple instructions. Kill. Protect. All right. I'm gaining money over time. I've got my little bobblehead here. Use cash to spawn units. Okay. Spawn units take up pip supply. You can only spawn as many uh, units as you have pip supply. Somebody was asking earlier what the pips represent in this game. Now we know. All right, so we can buy spawn war pip. Click here. So we got these two guys coming out. And we can uh, right click to, uh, to inspect them. Left click and drag or use A and D to move the camera. Okay, simple enough. Use the scroll wheel or W to S to zoom in and out. Okay, they're fighting. Your pip supply is full. You can only spawn as many units as you have available. Okay. So here we go. We got our three dudes. Let's see what happens. Pip pip cheerio. <laughs> you leveled up. Kill the enemies to gain XP. Okay. Whenever you level up, you get a combat point. All right. You can trade combat points for cash to buy more units. Or pip supply to increase your army size. Oh, nice. Try using these buttons to increase your strength and win the round. Okay. So I'm going to do pip supply. Yes. And now I can have another dude. Go, guys, go. Oh, my guys are amazing. Look at them. Look at them. Destroy this. Destroy it. Oh, my God. I'm so good at this. <laughs> I'm so good at tutorials. All right. Operation success. He's biting. He's biting the whole uh, lower third. What do we get? We get new units. Essential rifle pip, the backbone of your army. And we got a tactician. Support infantry calls down artillery strikes and buffs them. Buffs the accuracy of pips around them. Okay. After each successful operation, you get rewards. In this case, some new units. Anything you bring with you into an operation is consumed. This means everything in your army is in limited supply and can only be replenished by conquering new territories. Okay. Success in war pips is all about choosing when to deploy something and which combinations to use. Let's equip some units. Select the loadout tab at the top of the screen. Okay, I can do that. 
this is the loadout screen. It is used to uh, equip units, items, and constructibles to the deployment bar. This is your deployment bar. This bar represents the hot bar at the bottom of the screen used to spawn war pips during the operation you just played. Units slotted into the deployment bar will be available to use in your next operation. And once a unit item or constructible is slotted into the hot bar, it is consumed. Try to choose combinations of units that synergize well together. For now, let's equip the units you just gained. Okay. We got it. Great. Whenever you're ready, go ahead and deploy it to the next operation. All right, hold on one sec while we, uh... Let me just move something here. Boop. All right, I can see this is getting obscured there. All right, let's do that. Okay, deploy. Loop hero meets cover base shooter. Feels like a tug of war type thing, right? I think they even mentioned that on their Steam page. So we defend this, attack this. I love it. <laughs> I love how straightforward. Defend this. Attack this. All right. So what do we want this time? Okay. So this one doesn't become available for 40 seconds. So let's get a guy in there. Should we get two guys? Let's get two guys going. You may notice that you can spawn your war pip in slot one, but cannot yet spawn the tactician you equipped in the slot two. Some units like the tactician are locked behind an initial cooldown or are not available immediately. It's kind of like summoning sickness, eh? Try making a tactician when they become available. All right. I will. I'll leave one slot open. I'll leave one slot open for the tactician. All right. Central rifle pit, the backbone. Drafted reduces spawn cost from 25 to 20. Oh, okay. So they improve over time. Nice. Five seconds. Three. Oh, I can level up. Never mind. Let's go here. All right, your tactician unit is a support pip. This means their role is not to attack the objective, but rather to hang back and buff your main assault troops. Each unit in war pips has different attack characteristics. Even though you can't directly control your units, learning when to spawn them and in which order is the key to victory. Try spawning units in clusters to maximize their firepower and reduce trickle deaths. Okay, yeah, a lot of games, especially like team-based shooters and stuff, if you trickle in one at a time, you get obliterated. Keep in mind the different move speeds of your units. Okay, that's a lot. All right, let's do a cluster here. All right, ready? One. This bar shows the enemy's resource strength. The color along the bar represents the enemy's strength at that moment. Red means the enemy is sending lots of reinforcements against you. Green means the enemy is weak and will not send many reinforcements. This is when you want to plan your counterattacks and push for victory. Whenever you see a yellow warning strip on the bar, it means the enemy will be sending their strongest units against you. You have to play defensively to survive the onslaught during these powerful attack waves. Oh boy. You must destroy the objective before the end of the bar is reached. If you don't, the enemy will call in an airstrike and destroy your command center. Okay. Uh, clicking this button will increase your unit rank. After you spend four points on their button, all units will increase their unit rank. All allied units gain powerful upgrades with increased yank. Is that what we, we, we were seeing that uh, when I right clicked and inspected? Additionally, each unlocked rank will earn you more experience points per kill so you level up faster. All right, so we, how many people we got? All right, there's the tactician. Come on guys, buff, buff them. Oh, they're kicking my butt. We need more money. If you need more money, <laughs> the game heard me. This game hears when you talk. If you need more money, you can use combat points to upgrade your cash button. This will give you more cash each time you press it. Oh. Okay, I would press it. Press it again. I don't have any. All right, get in there. Another soldier. The guy, 
got to get behind cover. All right, here we go. The cash button will trade one combat point for cash. Okay. Oh, that up. Oh, I just upgraded cash button. Okay, so you can spend this to get more over time, more money over time, or just get like a one-time boost to your cash. Go guys, go. How fast is that guy gonna get here? There we go, shooting the objective. Cash button sounds like a game show. All right, we got it, nice. Army of Optimus says, oh, that's interesting. I've seen plenty of these linear auto battlers that turn into just grinding for inches. Putting a time limit in an indication of the flow of battle is a really smart innovation. Yeah, I think it's supposed to feel like a tug of war, right? You have to kind of like know when to push and when to sit back and defend. And uh, yeah, we'll see if my instincts in that regard uh, stay on track. Hi, Danimal Cracker. Welcome. All right, if anybody's enjoying this so far, this game will be in early access uh, starting today, the 29th. And uh, yeah, we're checking it out as a sponsored uh, stream for Dane Alec. All right, let's see what we get. Okay, we got the essential rifle pip. RA-52 rocket fires a low damage dumb fire rocket at a random target. Sandbags. Cover position for infantry and turrets, okay. So now we gotta build cover and stuff. Great job. We're now ready to attack the enemy's final objective and win the island. Win the island! Uh, the enemy, however, is much harder this time around. Oh, good. This bar shows you the enemy's total armor army strength. This affects how powerful enemy units are during an operation. Each time you conquer a territory, the enemy rallies and becomes stronger. This creates a trade-off. Do you try to advance directly to the enemy base and win the island while they're weak? Or do you try to gather supplies by attacking territories, allowing the enemy to gather strength? Yeah. The choice is up to you, but keep an eye on the enemy's army strength. It will drastically change the difficulty of each territory you attack. Okay. Uh, why is your reward soldier playing a loot? Is he a bard? Uh, yeah. Yeah, he's a bard. Mm -hmm. A scald. He wants to be called a, called a scald. Yeah. All right. So this is where we need to attack. Enemy lineup. We've got war fighters and shotgunners. And I can get a heavy gunner if we win. Enemy spawn waves. Okay. Oh. What does it say? At least one unit must be equipped in the hotbar. Oh, okay. We can do that. Load out. There are lots of different types of weapons, equipment, and units to deploy. While spawn infantry... Uh, units spawn infantry, vehicles, and aircraft to fight for you on the battlefield. Items are powerful, limited-use equipment like missile strikes, stim packs, tear gas, and landmines. Constructibles are offensive and defensive structures you can build in the world, such as sandbags, turrets, and barbed wire. Each one of these deployables has its own drawbacks and benefits. Try to experiment with different combos to find which ones work best together. Let's try all of them out in the next operation. Go ahead and slot in the war pip, rockets, and sandbags. Excellent. Let's try it. Yeah, we had to modify our loadout for that level. I think every time you get to a new level, you can modify it if there's changes. All right, I psh, wish me luck, gang. I have no idea. Uh, let's bring out a dude. You have some new toys this operation. Your rockets act a little differently than your war pips. Instead of spawning units to fight for you, they will launch directly at an enemy. The rockets do not take up pip supply, but must be reloaded when used up. Try firing some to get a feel how they work. Okay, let's fire one. Fire! Oh, I love that. That was fantastic. Your sandbags provide new cover positions for your war pips. All constructibles can only be placed behind the front line. So the further you push up, 
your units, the more places you can build. Try placing a sandbag now. Uh, I can only go up to here. Go hide! Wait, can I put another one? Wait. I want to put another one. Oh, you killed my guy. Stop that. Upgrade cash button. Yeah, let's get faster cash, right? Yeah. Is that not faster cash? Yeah, faster cash. These buttons are your assault and defend buttons, okay? The assault button will give your units a speed buff and increase their accuracy. Perfect for rushing the enemy. The defend button will make your units take cover and greatly increase their range. Use this when the enemy is coming in mass and you need to hold ground. Okay, very interesting. So you got some limited control of how your units move. Hi, Mr. Biggs. Both buttons can only be uh, charged up by getting kills. Using one button will drain the charge of the other. Use them wisely. Ah, okay, so it's one or the other. All right, we, right now, let's get a rocket in here. Boom. All right, I can't charge, I can't actually do these yet. Let's increase our pip size. There's no one over here I can make yet. This is the emergency button. It slides open when your enemy is close to your command center. Using this button will sacrifice one pip supply for two minutes and trade it for cash. Use this when you're in a bind and need some quick cash. Be careful with overusing the emergency button. You can easily reduce your army size to the point where you're unable to spawn new units. Okay. Let's go, guys. Push. So I gotta wait till we get up to here for the red dot. Let's try to upgrade our units. Go guys, go. Wow, there's so many, they have so many people. Not anymore! <laughs> okay. Feel free to give me advice, gang. Like, what do you think I should be, like, wor focusing on and stuff? Get in there. Come on, guys. Get a little closer and I can use that. Go! Attack! Oh, they're slaughtering our guys. They just killed them. I have no more rockets. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No units, only rockets? Oh, they're still on cooldown for a little while. I think once we, uh... Yeah, once we get them drafted, their cost co they cost less. Okay, go. Oh, I can hold it down? And it drains it while I'm holding it down. Ah, oh, that's how it works. It's not like a toggle on or a toggle off. There we go. Go, go, go. Yes! We did it! Operation success. That button is cool. When you hold that attack button. Alright, so we got the heavy gunner. Powerful but slow armored infantry fires explosive ammunition. Achievement unlocked. <laughs> I still got the sandbag. All right, this concludes the tutorial. Now you're ready for the real battle. Good luck, Commander. Oh, God. The training wheels are off already. You want to see the Easter event? War peeps? That would be great, Arrowwolf. War peeps. Yeah. 
<laughs> you would buy this instantly if that was the theme. Hardcore war between sugar birds. <laughs> All right, here we go. New campaign. Normal. Let's do it. And gang, if you're watching this live uh, on Twitch on April 29th, because you may be watching this on Steam, and it may be a replay if you are. Hello, this is a rerun uh, if you're watching on Steam. Um, but if you're watching uh, this on Twitch, you can type hashtag game and wishlist this game and help out the devs. All right, army customization. All right, well, our community is called the... Oh my God, typing that shoots bullets? It's pretty amazing. Our community is called the Ottoman Empire, so we got to go for it. Oh, we get this. Please be an otter. Is there an otter? Oh my god, what? All right, we're going to do the ghost. Where's red? I know you got red. There's no red. I know they don't have red. Okay, fine. I will be blue. Otter Pip Empire? Okay, we'll do that. Otter Pip. Otter Pip Empire. <laughs> okay, so enemy. We got Pistol Pip, Warfighter, Shotgunner, and the enemies. And these are our rewards. A turret. Oh, that would be nice. Smoke grenades? Conceals friendly infantry and vehicles so they're harder to hit. Okay. So, which place can we attack? The red ones would be harder, I would imagine, right? Oh, okay, maybe not. They have different rewards, too. Arms dealer. Mercenary. Basic gun for hire. But it needs five of these, like, transistor chips. I don't think I can buy these yet. Upgrades. Oh yeah, we need we need currency. Okay. So let's do our loadout. Okay, can only do one of those, even though I had two. Okay. Heavy gunner. Base defense turret. So once I so deploying these kind of like spends them, right? You'd have to buy them again for the next mission. Good morning, Regal Peach. What's going on? How you doing? All right, let's try it. Let's see how this works. Operation, ew, loose solid. Why does that sound terrible? <laughs> I'm glad you're feeling better, Wriggle Peach. All right, you wanna watch me get my butt kicked here? All right, does this increase like the cash button? Spend one combat point for 50 cash. Upgrade cash button. Okay, so now it's 75 when I hit this. Oh, I get it. Okay. And they're coming while I'm learning. Go, guys. Go. Activate the base defense. Oh, you hold. Okay. Medium range turret to defend the command center. Is that a nuclear bomb in the timeline? I don't know what that is in the timeline. That's making me nervous, though. So, upgrading these guys reduces their cost from 25 to 20. I wonder how worth it that is to do. Uh... Alright, we got three coming out at once. You're excited for tomorrow? Yeah, we're having a big bogathon tomorrow. 
All right, here comes three all at once. I don't see any place where we really need to put this in. Let's go. Can we go? Go. Go, go, go. There's nobody there. Go, guys, go. All right, we ranked them up. Go! Yes. Okay, great. Perfect. Operation success. She want all the soldiers to speak an awful British accent so they can say things like pip pip cheerio. <laughs> pip, pip pip pip. I want a hobbit unit named Pippin. There you go. How's that? All the pip puns. Okay. So basically when we deploy, everything acts as kind of like an inventory system. So for the loadout, you could see I got one of these as a reward. What is this? Oh, that's the smoke grenade. Okay. I didn't even use the base defense. Small turret. Let's try that. Now we gotta figure out where we're going. Oh, we can go here now. Different rewards. A shield pip. Beefy armored pip that can absorb small arms fire. Holy shit. That'd be pretty mushrooms cool. four months in a row. Signs of insanity are starting to show. <laughs> pip pip hooray. Pip pip hooray. Thank you, Phantom Lord, for the four months. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, all right. So this is what they were talking about. We can try to make a beeline for their base. Or we can try to gather resources on our way. I want to try to get this shield guy if I can. I can get the shield guy either way. Let's go this way. This way it seems an oil derrick provides a small amount of cash over time. Okay, interesting. War bucks. Alright, that's what those are called. War bucks. Daddy war bucks. And we actually have... Where does it show our war bucks? Up here. Ten. Mercenary. Rocket. Alright. And then we can upgrade. When we, when we start making mega cash... Could try that. All right, let's try this. Operation Young Microscope. I didn't bring sandbags this time. Let's see how this goes. All right, you guys ready? Once we get to 75, we're gonna. Put three together here. There we go. Three together should take that one little guy out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. There's another one. The controls in this are really, really clean, gang. Very easy to just use WASD to pan the camera or zoom the camera in and out. All right, we got one more dude. I'm gonna start increasing our ranks here, make them cheaper. Now, where can I deploy the, the turret? Oh, right here. Do it. Yes. Yes, that's amazing. I love that. Go, guys, go. You guys got this. Oh, yeah. So that's how you do it. We I pushed them all together. Really helped. I don't even think I needed the turret. The turret was just cool. You gotta love turrets as long as you're the one putting it down. Very true. All right, so we got the heavy gunner. The shield pip. And the oil derrick. Okay. So far, so good. I feel like being frugal, though. All right, what is this bomb? What is this? 
This looks tough. A stim pack heals all infantry and doubles their health for a short time. Base defense, tactician, war pip. You get puppies? A pip pup! Pip pup? This looks like a hard one, huh? Is that hard, any harder than the other ones? All right, let's go for it. All right, we gotta go for the dog, don't we? There's a sale on rockets. Okay, you sold me. They're selling rockets. Who am I to say no? All right. Um. Must for the puppies, huh? All right, we're gonna try. I'm gonna grab, is this a base turret or a normal turret? Oh, wait. That's a base turret. Okay, I'm... I'm gonna put one shield, dude. That guy, and then we'll do rockets. I hope that's enough. I hope it's enough. <laughs> Puppies where? Hopefully just on our team. Hey, Corley, it has an M41A pulse rifle in there, does it? I totally missed that. All right, here we go. We start off with two ranks. See here? I'm going to put that into... Number of pips. Wow, they're coming out strong. Okay, not so strong. All right. We got two more. Two more levels there. All right. Wow. That's a lot of peeps. Oh, I didn't want those to be shot. I wanted these to be shot. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna take some gold, some cash. All right. All right. They're all coming out together. Hopefully, this shield guy helps. Rocket. Boom. Okay. Go. Push. Push. Pick that watchtower out. Good. Go. No, shield guy first. <laughs> Don't you guys know about shield guy first? I don't think they know about shield guy first. Hey, Nahareem, what's up? <laughs> the M41A pulse rifle is from aliens? Oh, that's awesome. That's my last rocket for a while. Oi. We're going to need to upgrade our cash button, I think, on this one. Yeah, I think we're in trouble, gang. I think we're in trouble this time around. Enemy wave approaching. I don't have the cash. I don't have the cash to do anything. We're, we're, I think we're in serious doo-doo here. Yeah. Defend. Defend. There we go. Using the defense buff. I upgraded the units. They're in a car. Destroy the car. Slightly increases the shield pip's move speed. Okay. I'm gonna improve my cash button. Rocket. Rocket. Okay.
Rocket. Rocket. All right, go. Go, guys, go. Wow, this is much harder. You really like this game, Regal Peach? It's fun so far. I, I haven't played a game like this in a long, long time. In fact, I don't think I've ever played anything exactly like this. But I love the whole, like, momentum feel. That whole tug-of-war vibe. All right, now we have plenty of cash. I just don't know if we're going to be able to push through. I, I might not have chose the best loadout. Go, guys, go. Okay. Nice. Nice. All right. We're making, pushing through. I think that rocket only got one guy. Yes! All right, there we have it. Nice. Uh, were there mines on the bridge? I, I didn't notice that. There has to be a unit or tool that clears mines. Okay. Yeah. I don't know, Rex. Is there a way to remove or remote trigger the landmines? I'm not sure. Yeah. Hi, Nolan. I haven't played it yet. Yeah. All right, so we got all of this. Got the puppies, pit pups. Ooh, gives one, gives back one life. I wondered, my lives were full. I guess that's a waste. Can't go above three. Great. Great, 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 great. I wonder how good the dogs are. Check out our load out here. What do these guys do? Oh, I want to inspect you. Anti-infantry attack dog. Oh, wow. Look how involved this is. Weapons, sharp fangs. Uh, this is what it's good against, I guess. I don't, it, oh, this is, oh, these are the stats. How, how much damage it does? Four, one health, five move speed. Weapon range is close only. Accuracy is very high. Uh, that's pretty low. Special. They won't attack the enemy objective directly. This unit will only target infantry. Okay. <laughs> the bio. Woof, woof, grr. Bark, woof, woof, bark. Woof, yip, grr, bow. Wow, grr, bow. Woof, bark, bark. Hoorah. Okay. That's great. That was fantastic. All right, I didn't even know all of these stats. We've got stats, okay. That's pretty cool. What else? Can any of these guys deal with mines? Support unit, okay. This unit prefers to hang out in the back line, one advance on their own. Support infantry calls down artillery strikes and buffs the accuracy of piffs around them. Okay. Uh, powerful but slow armored infantry fires explosive ammo. I don't see anything that attacks the mines, though. That sounds like your LinkedIn profile, Nolan. <laughs> yeah, maybe check the upgrades. I don't think I have enough. No, it's expensive to do the upgrades. 60 or 50 seems to be our first. We could do this one. What is this? Unlocks an additional slot for the arms dealer that sells money generating items. Oh, I think I'm gonna hold on to it. Who's this Wiggler? A mercenary. All right, that's just a basic dude. They're cheap, though. You can, like... They only cost 20. 
There's a sale on a smoke grenade. Nah, I think we got enough. All right, let's pick where we're going. We can get more puppies here and tear gas grenades. Drops off a large platoon of warfighters to the front line. The longer we take to get to the end, the the more strength they will have. But then how strong we will be as well. Alright, let's go up here. Heartbreaking foot. Alright, we got... Uh, we'll try attack dogs. And... Let's try tactician. Kills all infantry and doubles their health. I'm going to save that. Maybe for the uh, the end. Conceals friendly infantry and vehicles so they're harder to hit. That's for the defense. More cash. Let's try smoke... Let's try a smoke grenade. Penta pan Penta the Panther. <laughs> What's going on? Thanks for clipping. <laughs> which, uh, Edot, I didn't see. I didn't see which unit. Had a 130 on it? I don't know. Hey, Bokikio. Welcome to War Pips. Oh, I love the flavor text on the dog. All right, so we're going to see how good the uh, the puppies are. Probably should have stopped, started with an upgrade cash button, but... There goes the dog. Look how fast. Look how fast. Oh, nice. Okay. I don't want to watch that. <laughs> I don't want to be... I suddenly don't want to be responsible for this anymore. Um... <laughs> They're great. <laughs> but puppies. Oh, the smoke grenade was terrible. All right. Here comes a large number of people. Here they are over here. I wish I had a I wish I had the missile now. Oh, not having the missile is gonna be interesting. I gotta save up for one of these tacticians. There we go. See with how these guys work. Is that a that's gonna blow up, isn't it? Go guys, go. Okay, so the dog just killed someone. He ran, runs back to the base. And then what does he do? And he drops off five bucks. How funny. They actually, like, steal cash? All right, we have to, we have to wait up. Uh, let's, let's, let's send in an army all together. Let's smoke bomb over here. And defend. Kill the- kill it! Yes. Yes. Okay. Send a dog. Send in the dogs. Oh no. Puppy, get back. Defend. Hey, go. Go, 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 go. The dogs mug people, I know, that's great. All right, I don't have smoke bombs yet. Uh...
Okay, we ranked up, everybody. Warning, enemy wave approaching. Oi. All right, defend. How many people? I have almost no people. Defend! I like how you can see the buff aura around the tacticians. I need cash. I wish I brought I think I I think I needed sandbags, right? Are they destroying my cover? What's the tank at the bottom? I think these are just um little uh stuff that you can get like this bobblehead, little collectibles. From what I understand. Let's go guys. Come on. Hang in there. I'm gonna need this emergency button. Right about there. Go. Get over there, guys. Go, puppy, go. What if we can get level three units? Now, the ebb and flow. Hey, rabbit, what's going on? Yeah, I think there's decorations, Doom Prophet. All right, I think we got to. Uh, we got to go out all together. We need a whole new army. Go guys, go. Come on, all together. You guys got this. Let's do the best around. And no one's gonna ever keep you down. Go! Smoke right here. Smoke. Smoke right there. I think that was a good smoke bomb. I think that was a good smoke bomb. Yes! Yes! Wow. All right. It's going well so far. All right. What do we got? Sandbags. Another pit pup. Another heavy gunner, which we haven't used yet, right? And tear gas grenades. I'm going to save, like, a lot of our big stuff for this last... Can we do the last battle yet? No, we can go here. What is this? Tanya. It's a hero. Oh, they have heroes in this game. That's pretty cool. We got to fight Tanya. Should we just go right for it? See, do we have anything any good upgrades 55 we can get this increases all infantry magazine capacities by 50 percent we can get this starts the round with one extra pip all vehicles gain a large health increase yeah The cash button is interesting because it doesn't increase resource flow. It only increases subsequent selling of XP points for money. Really? Um, Starts around, yeah. And we also got this one. Fire an additional salvo for all missile items before reloading. Okay. So is that like your rockets or your smoke grenades? You get one extra shot before you have to reload? Yeah. Hi, fish heads. What's going on? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. 
By the way, if you're just tuning in, we are doing um, a sponsor stream for Daedalic Entertainment. Uh, we are streaming War Pips right now, which is going to be available in early access for everyone uh, at 1 p.m. Eastern on the 29th of April, which is today if you're watching this live on Twitch. Uh, you can type hashtag game wishlist it if it's interesting to you or purchase it once it comes out uh, in about an hour or so. And uh, then you can play right along for the early access period. Yeah. Um, I think... I think all I'm going to do with this. I'm going to extend their magazines on infantry. All right, let's do a loadout. I'm assuming this is still infantry. Uh, and this guy actually says support infantry. And then, okay, so these are all infantry. And an anti-infantry attack dog. All right. Um, what are we fighting for this fight? We're fighting war fighters, shotgunners, and sharpshooters. Oof. And I don't have smoke bombs, do I? Oh, I don't have enough. Yikes. All right, so let's do sandbags. Um, tear gas grenades. I kind of think I should save that for the final battle. It's and can you double up too? No, you can't double up, so you can't have like different cooldowns or whatever for some of the things. All right, what do you guys think? These four? This will generate a small amount of cash over time. Why it won't let me... Uh... Oh, this difficulty is a five. And what's the difficulty like here? Oh, I can't actually attack this. Oh, I have to go here or here first. Okay. So let's try here. They've got a sharpshooter, a buggy, and a warfighter. Yeah. So I gotta go here first. And this one, it's still a five. All right, let's try it. Let's see what happens. So let me try to explain this real quick at the beginning, Army of Optus. See if we we, we uh, understand this at the same time here. Is it called Watery Stomach? Operation Watery Stomach. Okay. So look, this button here w will uh, increase how much money I get when I click this button. Both of them spend this resource. So look, now I'm gonna get 75 if I hit this button, but I, it's it, it's basically it spends a level. Let's get three of them out here. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so you, when I level up over here, this little metal, I can spend it on increasing how big my army is with these pips, how much money I will get when I click this button. I can click this button and get the money that's listed here, or I can rank up my people. It takes four levels to rank them up, and each, each one would have a different, like condition I'm going to click this so I can get the money generator. All right, where do we put this? Right there. Okay. Look at it. It's spilling all over the place. That can't be good. I like the music too. So those oil rigs are the only way to get more cash flow out of the objects that I have right now. Yeah. There's also this emergency button here. 
The emergency button will work too. All right, I'm gonna start ranking up my people. I'd like to try uh, level two uh, heavy gunners. Go. All right, heavy gunner slightly increases the heavy gunner's health. Okay. All right, here he comes. Look how slow he is. So at this part, we're just kind of farming experience a little bit. You're, the guys just automatically fight. Hey, Paladin, what's going on? Yeah, they automatically fight, but you can kind of influence things by like, you know, I could place a sandbag like here, help them get cover. Get cover. Get out there, go. All right, we got another level. Uh, yeah, we'll go here. Another heavy gunner. Heavy gunner's doing work, I think. Go, go. Get in there. There you go. Oh, wow, that was a lot faster than I thought. Wow. Yeah. You can spend a point for a 20 plus 25 cash on button push or just push the button for $50 now. It means every upgrade is only worth it if you click the cash button at least three times. At least for the first one. I'd have to math it out. Yeah. Nope, nope. Yeah, it, uh, getting the instant cash is better if it's going to be short like that, for sure. Yeah. How many oil derricks can you have is the real question. There's limited places where you can put them, but I don't know. All right, we got another oil derrick. War pip, shield pip, heavy gunner. Um, I don't know yet, Rabbit. Let's wait. Uh, let's, let's see what happens in an hour. Yeah, sorry, I don't have that info. It will be a 20% discount on this game when it goes live uh, in early access. So that's going to start in about an hour. Um, Okay, so now we can actually try to beat the mission, like meet, beat this whole scenario. Oh, no, 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 we still have two more. Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm so, uh, so excited. Can't do anything really new here. Unless I wanted to do. Reduces heat per shot on all turrets. Improves base turret accuracy and range. Fire an additional salvo for all. Oh, wow. Do we want that or we want to save it up? I guess we'll save it. All right. We're going to go for this. Warfighter, shotgun, or sharpshooters. My loadout. Normal infantry. Dogs. These. Um, give me a heavy. Okay, let's go. And then we'll go all out for the last mission. See what happens. Operation Outrageous Rocket. Yeah, you have to wait a minute and a half before you can get your heavies out. Okay, let's get three of them in position. Enemy wave approaching already? Jesus. Uh, okay. Give me, give me some fast cash. The dog just so the dog gives you cash. That's so interesting, right? Yeah, they give you five bucks, but they but then they disappear. So they kill one guy and then they give you five bucks on the way back. Is that what it is?
That guy up in the front is toast. I need 20 gold. 20 bucks. Give me 20 bucks. There you go. I need cash, gang. Unleash the hounds! Yeah, they're basically like missiles. And then they despawn, but they give you five bucks back. So they cost like ten. Yeah. Hounds refund 66 of the purchase cost of the pip up makes it back. Okay. And they give you 100% if they're ranked 3. Interesting. Okay. I feel like the puppies are good if you spam them as spending your 10 overall to get a kill. Okay, yeah. Alright, let's try to rank up. I want to know what these buffs... Okay, orders all units to rush the enemy. Move speed plus weapon accuracy. And this one is units take cover and defend. Cover bonus and weapon range. Oh, you can increase their range. It's funny. You can use the defense button offensively. All right, we got rank two people. I wonder if that... If that... Retroactively impacts everybody that's already out here or not. Uh-oh, snipers. Oh, the snipers tore me up. Go, go dogs, go. Oh no, got him. Get the snipers. Get the snipers. Man, we were so close. And I need the cash. That heavy is going to be taken out. Or maybe not. Look <laughs> at the heavy doing work! Holy crap! I should have taken the cash. I'm dumb. Get in there! Shoot! Oh, no. Dead now. There's nothing I can do with you. There's no sandbag placement. There's one here I could do. All right, go guys, go. Come on guys, go. You gotta hit it like one more. There you go. <laughs> you needed one more shot. <laughs> All right. Enemy army strength grows the longer you take. All right, we're up to 35 Daddy Warbucks. It's okay, we're getting pretty good loot. What is this? An oil barrel. Sells barrel of oil for instant cash. Oh, interesting. Hmm. You feel like you just make heavies once they unlock that guy? They were way more powerful, weren't they? I mean, let's look at them. The heavies. They have a three for health. As opposed to... Oh, these guys have all the health. Yeah, but these guys have a three health and how much attack? Two, two attack, three health. Two attack, one health. Two attack, one health. And four attack, one health. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, these guys are great. All right, let's go. Um, let's 
Let's attack the final battle here. We gotta fight Tanya. Shotgunner Warfighter. Alright, what do we got? We need, uh... We'll take infantry. Heavies. Puppies. Oil, Derek. That. Sell for cash. Um... Toxic weight. I'm just gonna go all in here. Let's let's use all the things. See what it's all like. And upgrades. Anything we really want? Arms dealer. No. I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. Ooh, we can buy this though. Bulwark surface missile. Launch a high-speed accuracy strike missile to the specified location. Oh, do I get to uh, target that? Wow. All right, let's grab this. Go back to the loadout. Uh, Rabbit says, uh, so you need to buy the loadout. Yeah, this is like an inventory, and once you deploy it to a mission, it's gone. Win or lose. Yeah. But most of the stuff I got are from the rewards from the missions. All right, so what do we, what do we get rid of here to get the missiles? Let's get rid of the toxic stuff. We'll take that. All right, let's try it. Operation Green Mosquito. Start. Okay. Give me that EXP. It's easy as do re mi. Gotta kill that tower. Taking out that watchtower early would be nice. Come on, guys, you got this. Got another level. I miss? No, not a miss. Okay, good. <laughs> that was a good missile, I feel. Uh. Oh, there's a guy right there. What are you doing? How'd that guy get there? Holy crap. I gotta watch that. Guy got behind me. Yeah, there's a crap ton of landmines over here. You're right. Let's blow it. See, let's see if this blows up the landmines. Oh, it does. Oh, that makes it great. That's fantastic, then. Let's get some cash. Longer range. All right, receive 20 cash, whole, all right. So I can receive 20 cash on this. Is there a cooldown? Oh, there is. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. All right, I just stimmed my, my peeps. Everybody got healed there. Warning, enemy uh, wave approaching. Yeah, you gotta click that on cooldown. Yeah, you're right. All right, here's here's Tanya. Is that her name? Missile. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, Tanya. And that goes too. Okay. 
Perfect. Click that for money. Thank you. Click this. Click that. Spawn that. Spawn this. I like the cheaper inf infantry now. Send out a puppy. Get behind the sandbags, guys. I need cash. Right here. Oh, look at that. They're already going on to the command center. Oh, nice. All right, give me cash. Go, guys, go. Go. Good morning, Nair Bear. Oh, awesome. Glad you got your second dose of the vaccine. Congratulations. All right, we did it, guys. Yeah, it was easy. Uh, oh my god, I love steak. Welcome to the stream. And uh, I totally agree with your name. Steak is great. Okay, so we beat the whole first scenario. Nice. What do we got here? War pip, tactician, times two, an oil derrick, a drone swarm. This interruption is brought to you by a 32-month resub. Oh, it was Onres. Thank you so much for the 32-month resub. How you doing? <laughs> Welcome. Uh, a drone swarm launches a swarm of explosive kamikaze attack drones. Oh, interesting. And another smoke grenade. Achievement unlocked. I'm an island instigator. Okay, first scenario done. Yeah. You just got your first vac shot an hour ago, uh, I Love Steak? Congratulations. Amazing. Yeah, well, I just got my second shot a, a couple weeks ago. So, I'm super excited. Yes. Okay, so if anybody's just tuning in, we're doing a sponsored first look at this game, War Pips, which is going into early access in less than an hour. It's going to be 20% off on Steam during uh, this initial little push. Um, and you guys can help out our sponsor, Daedalic Entertainment, by typing hashtag game, if you're live on Twitch here, and clicking the link on Steam and wishlisting this game if it looks interesting to you at all. You know? Wishlist it. Help them out. It doesn't cost you anything. Yeti Cornea. Oh, congratulations. I'm sorry you're not feeling great. But hopefully that clears up soon. All right. Let's see what happens here. We got a new map. All right, we're starting at the star. We got to get to the flag. Wow, it's going to get more and more complicated as we go on. Wow, look at look at some of the rewards. An LRV. Puma. All right, one step at a time. We can go here or here. They both reward us with a heavy. This one gives us the uh, small turrets. Let's go this way. Let's go that way. Um, upgrades. We have 125 now. Oh, okay, so basically we can buy any anything we want. Makes Open the door. Get on the. <clears throat> Thank you for the resub. <laughs> Thank you for that resub. Virginity, what's going on? How you doing? Oh, I remember you, Yeti. Yeah, absolutely. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. What does this bomb on the map do? I don't know. Orbital uplink stat. I don't know. I don't know. This says extra life. It gives you a life back. Okay. I'm assuming you could fail three times before you have to start over because you have lives up here. Um, okay, so what was this? Makes all constructibles cost 50% less to build. Sandbags, pump jacks, small turrets, etc. Assault and defense buttons fill up faster. Increases XP per kill. I think we do that. Starts the round with one extra pip. That's good, too. Uh, I think we want to level up quicker. And then I still have 50 left over. Okay, let's do that. Both of those. My loadout. 
take a war pip. I'm gonna start off with just with war pips, I think. Um You know, we have so many of these. Let's let's have one and one. <laughs> Misty Potato is the name of this uh scenario. The Misty Potato. Take smoke grenades. All right, let's try it. The other guy says, I like that I'm sitting here going, no, pick this or maybe that or that because it looks like there's several ways to approach this. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, this is pretty neat. Not gonna lie. I'm enjoying this. All right, so we got two, uh, two levels to start. I go here. Um... Get three of them to start. Let's do that. Yeah. Okay, we should be getting more experience per kill now, which is good, which helps us level up. Okay, anybody? This is where we level up. You can see the medals here, and then I get to spend those points to get more people by increasing my pips, more instant cash, uh, or level up my people, which do different things. You can see drafted and listed for level two and level three there. Okay. These buttons over here give me a defensive buff or an offensive buff. Oh, there's the offensive buff is behind my fat head here. Wow, we're actually making short work of them. So we probably don't even need to do much here. Boom. Oh, here comes a big wave though. All right, smoke grenade. We're obscured. Wow, that must help them a lot. Just sitting there in the smoke. Woo! Okay. Edot, you would have done the same upgrades. Good starts to the battle and better ramp up. Always good. I, I, I think the experience points is great because you want those level ups. Yeah. Heavy gunner, sandbags, and small turret. Yeah. Uh, Doom Prophet says, do you uh, do you think you'll have time to try and see how it performs with controller? The, the, the page, the Steam page is full controller support. All right, let's take a look. Uh, let's see. We noticed that you have a controller plugged in. Would you like to play Warpers using the controller instead of the mouse keyboard? Yes. Okay, so you have to use the menu system on the top. Uh, yeah, so it's got that. Um, let me see what. Let me let me navigate the menus with the mouse, if I can. Oh no, you, you got to choose one or the other, huh? How can I go back? <laughs> see what I did for you. <laughs> Doom Prophet, it does have controller support, but it seems like you have to choose one or the other. It kind of changes the, the UI a bit. Hey, Mr. John. Hey, Heliquin. What's going on? Um, I don't know how to get it back to uh, mouse and keyboard, though. So I'm just going to save and exit real quick. Are you sure you want to exit the game progress since the last operation has been saved? Okay, yeah. Just do that real quick. Oh, disconnect it, maybe. Yeah. Oh, well, there we go. Even better. Corley, you're my hero. All right, so they do have controller support, Doom Prophet, but I don't want to uh, mess myself up. Corley, you, you're my hero. All right, let's go. Um, let's see what we're going to be fighting. We can go here. Ooh, what's this? Barbed wire. Slows and damages enemy infantry vulnerable to vehicles. All right, let's go there. Let's go to the island. Fighting war fighters, uh, war fighters, shotgunners, and UAZ. 
Move this guy down here. I don't think we I don't think we need more than just the normal infantry in terms of our units, right? Let's try kamikaze drones. I only have one heavy. They want me to buy mercenaries or smoke grenades. And I can save there. Let's try that. It's nice that it's seamless when you connect or disconnect it. Yeah, hey, absolutely. Yeah, it, I love how it just detected that I had it and then uh, allowed me to get rid of it <laughs> by just unplugging it. All right, here we go. Let's go with you just this for and this. Seven months, man. Dad, you're a man beast, baby. Yeah, that's Mr. John the man Much beast. Love otters and bog. Shout out to the peeps who have been gifting me the last few months who have been having a rough time in finances. This game reminds me of FTL and Into the Breach. Looks cute as heck. Thank you so much, Mr. John, for the 37 months. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to War Pips. All right, big enemy wave approaching. Uh-oh. Should've given myself a cash boost. Maybe a little cash boost. Wow, that's a lot of people. I like the soundtrack too. It's pretty awesome. All right, now I'm gonna have level two troops. They're just cheaper in this. Another level. Let's just let's just swarm them. Swarm. We're not close enough for me to put this down yet. Swarm. There we go. Now we're close enough for the sandbag. Extra cash. All right, what does the drone do? Oh, I have to pick where it goes? Here. <laughs> Wait, that cost only 10 bucks? That's only 10 bucks? And I get 18 of them? Oh, hell yeah. What? <laughs> That's fantastic. Okay, I have no, I have no army though. <laughs> There's my problem. No army. I got, I had so much fun with the drones. Lots of EXP. Give me some cash. Give me some cash. Aw. Oh. Hope everybody's having a great day so far today. Don't forget to wish list war pips even if you're not ready to buy it helps out the devs and thanks so much to didelic entertainment and skirmish mode games for sponsoring today's segment i'm streaming this live on twitch uh on april 29th if you're watching the stream and it's not 
April 29th. You may be watching a rerun on uh, Steam. But you can always come over and hit that follow button on Twitch. I'm at twitch.tv slash bogotter. B-O-G-O-T-T-E-R. Twitch.tv slash bogotter. I stream live Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern most weeks. We play a whole variety of games. Would love if you would check it out. All right. Um, we're almost going to get level three. This is a longer mission. I'm excited. This, this will make them really cheap. 15 per unit. And then I think we just pump up the pits, the pips, and overwhelm them. Come on, give me one more level. Oh boy. All right. Right here. All right, here we go. Maximum level. Probably should pump some cash at that point, right? So we have a time limit here. Doesn't hurt vehicles, I don't think. All right, we got two people. Oh, they just got slaughtered. I got no people right now. We need an infusion of cash. And you can see we're getting closer to the end of this uh, tug of war here. I think we should level up. Give me some cash. Give me the cash! Okay. Go, guys, go. Now's a chance. There you go. There you go. Boom. Got it. Operation success. All right, so we got the barbed wire and a shield pip and a war pip and a heavy gunner. Nice. My pips have been pumped, Nolan. Oh my. Okay. Three different avenues. Oh, we get the uh, the rocket as a reward for that one. Pistol pip, weak, low damage, enemy grunt. Oh, I love this. I love the oil barrel. That's such a fun uh, item. All right, let's check out our upgrades. We got, oh, we only have 25. Okay, so. This has got a base defense turret. Okay, I don't think I'm going to buy anything. We'll go with our basics. Let's do with the heavies. Let's do one oil rig. Base defense? No, I don't think we need base defense. I haven't tried the toxic chemicals yet. Let's try that. Should be good. Well, Unrest says, Bog Otter's Pips brings all the peoples to the channel. <laughs> Indeed. Thank you for being here, gang. I really appreciate it. And thank you for supporting our sponsor today. Okay, we got another sponsored game we're gonna be looking at, also from Daedalic Entertainment, Inca Lunati, which I backed on Kickstarter. We're gonna be checking that out after this segment. All right, so let's go with this and this. Wow, that is a lot to start. Should I launch tear gas? This 
kind of hold them off. Wow, this is a little bit of a rough start here. There you guys go. You got it. Okay. Go. Go, 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 go. Lose speed. Okay. One more level, and then we'll have cheaper units. What does it do with the, the heavies? The heavies just get cheaper too? All right, here comes toxicity. <laughs> okay, is that like a damage over time on them? Maybe, and now we can have heavies. Okay, more health on these guys. They don't cost less, they're more health. All right. Yeah. Is it raining in the game? Yeah, there is, there's the weather, there's weather effects. Hide. I'm gonna try to go to level three. I think this is gonna be a longer mission. I gotta save up for the oil ring too. Let's just get the oil rig. Looks like there was another spot for one over there, too. Defense, guys! Defense! There's a watchtower down here. Gotta take that out. I think I need cash. Let's go. Left, right, left. I'm not using puppies anymore. They steal money. They're not, they actually don't steal money. They just uh, refund some of the money if they get back to base and then they despawn. So, and I have no more puppies in my inventory right now. Yeah, so they run, they kill, they kill a guy, and then if they get back to base, they refund some of their, uh, their cost. Alright, one more level, and we should be have cheap inventory, uh, cheap, cheap infantry. There we go. And our, uh, heavies should have more health. Gotta kill these towers. Go, tower kill. Tower kill, yes. Go, 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 kill it. Kill the tower. This tower right here is what I'm talking about. Kill that. Yes. Oh. That's what he said. Okay, if we gain levels, maybe I should... Uh, yeah, let's do this so that the next time we hit this button, it'll give us 75. Then we should be in business. Then we should be in business. Anyone know what this game will be priced eventually? Uh, is it eleven ninety nine? Is your info the in-game time show? Okay. Yeah, and I think it's going to be twenty uh, twenty percent off on Steam uh, to start because it's it's heading into early access today. All right, we got two oil rigs now. Did all my people die, pretty much. Go. You guys got this. Give me the cash. All heavies, all the time. Yes. All right, we're finally getting to their side. All 
All right, we got three heavies coming in. And toxic waste. Oh, my favorite sound effect in the game right there. Alright, I got reinforcements coming in. Destroy them all. Uh-oh, enemy wave. Oh, guys you got this you got this yeah Ida, you're right yeah they have to be mixed you can't just have all heavies yep I love how the beginning island, like, very easy, get the feel of it, and now you can all of a sudden see how the difficulty's gonna ramp, and, like, the enemies are gonna get more complicated. It's great. Alright, what did we get? We got war pips, drone swarm, I love these rockets, and, ooh, oil barrels are great, too. Great fun. Beautiful. 35 war bucks. Wow. Um, I think I'm going to hold off. I'm going to save up. Anything interesting here? No. We haven't really tried these guys, but... Should we try them? How much do they cost to summon? 20. Spawns two mercenaries for one supply. Spawn three mercenaries for one supply. Does that mean pip per pip? Oh, you could just really swarm then, huh? All right, I'm going to try them out. Let's just do something different. All right, where are we going? We can attack here and get puppies. Or here and get a, a whole bunch of turrets. This one looks really tough. This guy's got RPGs. Role-playing games. Oh, I love role-playing games. This has got a buggy and the other vehicle. Oh, this has both too. Wow. All right, so this one's harder. Um, did someone say puppies? There's puppies right here. Pip pup. All right, let's take our team. We got to take them. We're going to take our new cheap guys. Um, hold on to the heavy gunner. Let's try the shield guys. Sandbags, that. Abortive worm is the name of this mission. Oh, great. Let's try this. Worm. Okay. Here we go. Ready? Go! I can't wait to say spawn two mercenaries for one supply. Now, let's see how these guys do. With their submachine guns. So far, so good. Oh, they just ran into the barbed wire? That's what they do? They just run right into it? 
Okay. Why don't they avoid the barbed wire? I don't know. <laughs> it seems like something they should do. Come on, get him! Get that buggy! Get the buggy! There we go. Okay, they're just gonna run right into it again? Oh, they're lucky he's getting hurt. Right into it, he walked. The other guys got around it. Drone attack. I think I missed. Alright, this is... Going pretty well so far. That was... Wow. The drone takes forever to get there. There we go. Alright, so when I do this, it summons... Oh, it summons two at once. They're already attacking the command center. Wow. There we go. Go, guys, go. Shoot it! Shoot it faster! <laughs> There's nobody there! Shoot it! <laughs> no! Oh, we had that! We had it! They pushed us back. Damn. That was close. Alright, we need to regroup. The mercs are dropping their clips when they reload. Oh, that's pretty cool. I don't get to see little details like that. Can you shoot a drone at the objective? I don't think so, no. Uh, no. I mean, is that gonna do any damage on this? No. That would just be kind of cheap, wouldn't it? Go guys, go. They always move. Man, I suck with those. Another buggy? Another enemy wave. Crap! I need cash. Can you use the drone to take out barbed wire? Uh... Nope. It's like infantry only. There. This is crazy. Oh, man. We leveled up again. I don't know if I should go for level three. Oh, man. These guys are going to get slaughtered. 
This is a bad wave. I gotta hit my emergency button for cash. Give me some cash. Come on! Hang in there, guys! They're shooting my command center. Oh, God. That should give me three. That should give me three every time I click this button. The little mercenaries. And they only cost one pip. Three more. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on! Fight back! I can't believe how we were so close to beating this and then... Uh-oh. Not so much. Alright. Pushing them back. I don't know what's better. Do you think three mercenaries or or one uh, level three of one of these guys? I, I think the the mercenaries are better at this point because these guys only reduce their costs when you level up. These guys actually give you three for one. How many will die on the wire? Probably all of them. Go. You guys got this right here. Nice. Wow. That went back and forth. I That was interesting. I love the tug of war feel. Really well done. Okay. Ebb and flow, ebb and flow. We got the pit pop, mercenary, smoke grenade. All right. We probably have time in this segment to do like one more mission. Um, what is that? Landmines, defensive anti-vehicle landmines, and an LRV. Are you kidding? Those are the rewards. This one we get a uh, a Puma. Oh my God! Ramrod, powerful battle tank. So what does that symbol mean? Does that mean there's gonna be like an event in the timeline? Looks like War Pips is purchasable now for $9.59 since people are asking. Hashtag game, gang. Type hashtag game in the chat. Click the link, please. Wishlist it if you're not ready to purchase. And if you wanna get the game, it should be available now. First day in early access. Super fun so far. Yeah. Wow. All right, let's try this this, this mission here. We'll, we'll go all in. We'll see if we can do it. 45. Can't really purchase any big upgrades, unfortunately. Fire an additional salvo. Reduces heat per shot of turrets. I kind of want those. I kind of want these bigger things. Okay, let's go with War Pips, a heavy. Tactician. Rockets. Turrets. And sandbags. And this. Yes. That's a lot of stuff, but I think we might need it. Is there a way to buy and support you? Uh, there's no, there's no like humble link or anything like that, Gigabon. But thanks for asking. Yeah, since this is a sponsor stream, supporting our sponsor is the way to help. Yeah, so just click that link. It should track for us. Wishlisting helps them out. Yeah. 
and they'll they'll track uh, purchases from that link as well. So just use that link if you're gonna buy it. That'd be great. Thank you. All right, let's try this. Hi Hex, how you doing? And uh, after we finish War uh, War Pips today, we've got another sponsored segment for uh, Inca Lunati, which is a game I backed on Kickstarter. I'm super excited about. So check that out. Yeah. Okay, what do we want to start? Um, start like that. Bring those all out. Alright, we got level two. I want to save up fairly early and try to get uh, an oil derrick. Should have hit that button first. I wasted money. Oh man. Where did that go? Oh my god, no. Here, go here. No, right here. Jesus Christmas. I'm overwhelmed. Okay. Go, guys, go. Wow, the start of this was tough. Uguska, so is it worth it? I think it's great fun so far. Yeah. This isn't my typical type of game either. And I, I just, I, I like the whole thing. Um, Give me the cash. Got heavy out there. Sandbag. This is a hard mission, so we'll see how this goes. Okay, we got some support behind the heavy. Getting to level. Okay, since I hit the emergency button, I think it destroys a little some of your pips, right? Oh, please, please get this big group. No! All right, well, we got a uh, different group. Get a turret up there. I wish I could control these rockets. All right, last one. destroy my turret before I can even use it. <clears throat> Thank you, Corley, for purchasing the game. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Where can I put this? Up here? Wow, we're having a lot of trouble here early on. They're shooting my oil rig that I just put down. I'm not going to be able to defend it. Nothing I can do. Are we going to are we going to end our run? On the very uh, last mission? Come on, guys. Yeah. 
Hold out. You can do it. We got our missiles back. There it is. Okay. Gotta push them back. Gotta put one more level. And then we'll have max level troops. All right, there we go. Max level troops. These should be cheaper. What do these guys do? More health. And these guys reduces the delay between artillery strikes. Okay. Gotta bounce back. I need cash. I need cash so bad. Emergency button. Oh no, I think we're done. We are done. Emergency cash! Come on! I have a level. Comeback time? I don't know. I don't know. I'm holding down this button to see. And... Okay, we got our missiles. That should help. Here, can we push forward to this and somebody use that? Okay, get these two turrets up. Good. Controlling these rockets needs better aim. All right, we leveled up. What do we want to do? Come on, stay alive. Stay alive, I only have two people. I need cash. Oh god, here comes a whole bunch. Cash! Alright, we got a whole... A whole brigade coming now. And here comes their brigade. Fantastic. Heavy gunners or MVPs? Yeah, they're expensive though. They cost a lot. Give me those levels. Give me those levels. Rockets. Rocket. Rocket. Come on, give me a nice rocket. Good one. Yes, that was great. Oh, we got two levels. All right, some cash. Thank you. What's the Bogathon tomorrow gonna be? We're gonna do a 14 hour long stream tomorrow and uh, we're gonna play Returnal on the PS5. Yeah. Is this a go until you die kind of game? Um, you, I have to destroy their base, they have to destroy my base. This is one mission. You get three lives to get to the other end of the island, but this is just one mission on that island. Oh, they're gonna kill my turret. Come on, turret, go. Do some work. I guess I gotta save up and... Well, let's, let's put these guys out there. We don't wanna lose too much ground.
can't believe they're still they're still coming. Man. I need cash more than anything. Thin out their numbers. Thin out their numbers. Alright, those missiles are pretty darn good. Cash. Cash is king. Airstrike incoming. Oh god, we're at the end. We're gonna lose, I think. Here comes the airstrike. It's me right here. <laughs> okay. That's a bad place for my turret, I think. Alright, uh... And here they come. I'm trying to save up some cash so I can put out a big army at once, but I don't know how, much, how, how well that's working out for me. They can shoot much further away when you hold down the, uh, the defense buff. All right, here we go. Let's go for our push. Cash here. There we go, there we go, there we go. Another airstrike though. Oh, oh, they got the thing. How do you get your pips back from the emergency? I think you just have to wait it out. Yeah. I think you're not being able to kill their vans was a big problem because they get more units from those. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So there we go. There's our first failure, which I'm using to illustrate what happens just to show you guys, you know. Okay. So our, our uh, level should be down one. Yeah. So we didn't take the territory over, so we don't get rewards. You expend, We expended the units from the loadout. Uh, my lives didn't go down, though, interestingly enough. I was expecting this to go down to a two, but maybe it's because we got an extra life earlier and maybe you can have more than three lives. I'm not sure. Uh, Rainami says, so here's something interesting. They have a bundle for th uh, other three other Daedalic publisher games and War Pips. I have the other three and it's cheaper to buy the bundle than just for the game itself. Oh, nice. Yeah, so gang, there is a Daedalic Entertainment publisher sale that just went live a few minutes ago. I wasn't allowed to talk about it till just now, but it... From now until, uh, I think, Monday, May uh, 3rd. Yeah, until May 3rd, there's a sale on Steam for a bunch of Daedalic Entertainment titles. So check that out on Steam. Support our uh, our sponsor today, Daedalic. There's a whole bunch of games on sale. Including 20% off on War Pips, which is now in early access. Type hashtag game, click the link, wishlist it. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. What did you guys think? Very interesting game. There's so many different units. Snipe. Oh, you're going to lock snipers, vehicles, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, we're just scratching the surface. And the game's in early access, so it's not even in its final form yet. It'll evolve over time. Yeah. Maybe lives is when you, when you run out of things for a loadout. Yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure exactly. But check this out. Uh, thanks to the Dalek Entertainment. Uh, once again, uh, my name is Richie, a.k.a. Bogotter. If you're watching on Steam, uh, this is a rerun of a broadcast we did live on Twitch. You can come on over to twitch.tv slash Bogotter and say hello if I'm streaming or hit that follow button if I'm not. I stream typically Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. And thanks once again for the Dalek Entertainment for uh, sponsoring today's stream. Um, Wishlist, Warpips. Check it out. Super fun.